Well, well, if he's around, you can try. I haven't even seen him this morning. Anyway, good luck. I'm out of here. All right, welcome to uh, the CCC, uh, the 4v4. This is Sun Tzu versus OP. Um, to, uh, I mean, we're all strong civs here. Let's see what we've got. I'm going to uh, get the players to rename their caps. So this is a big U shape. So this is a big U shape. Interesting. Let's see if the teams are on both sides by random. There's El Stretcho up here. Ah, with Blaze. Man, this is going to be a bloodbath. With three city states to the south of them. A whole bunch of cities, okay. Uh, Liskey, next to Stockholm. Washington, okay. Baggy tax, arc tip, Taz, his way over here as text I think blaze is in trouble actually uh, I mean he's got he's got stretch over here he'll have eagle warriors once he finds him he's probably gonna try and rush All the CSs are clustered. Oh, there's uh, there's Eiffel. So we've got Blaze with two uh, OPs over here. That doesn't sound good for him. Um, Liskey here, another OP player. T soft right here. Baggy tax here, arc tip here. So arc tip might be uh, in trouble because he's surrounded by uh, KC. And Blaze is surrounded by OP. Uh, well, it worked out the same. This, this may end up as a 3v3.
All right, uh, looks like uh, Aztecs and uh, Greece know each other's there. Of course, Eiffel is working his warrior up. Maybe they're going to try a warrior rush on uh, Greece. Liskey's got another scout out. Yeah, right now people are just scouting about trying to find the other team. Going to be an interesting game. <laughs> yeah, Blaze could be in trouble over here eventually. An arc tip could be in trouble over here on this side.
Well, uh, Tsop and uh, Liskey definitely are aware of how close they are to each other. Not sure if Baggy or Tsop got first uh, meet on Stockholm. Let's see here. Okay, that's right. I did because I'm the host, so no one gets first moves on or first meets on on CSs, but they both would have met them. That's a peculiarity of the observer mode. I get first meet on all the CSs, so none of the players do. Well, Lisky's got a settler out. Baggy Tax has a settler out. Stretcho's got one out, and so does Blaze. Blaze has a settler out. Stretcho has a settler out. Liskey has a settler out. T-Sop not yet. Baggy Tax has a settler out. And Arctep, not yet.
I wonder if TSOP will try first moving that settler. <laughs> Uh, he's got the scout there now. Oh, now the warrior. <laughs> Efel's got a settler out now. El Stretcho's got a settler out and scout and his first worker. I don't think he's going to try a rush yet. Actually, Aztec warriors aren't cheap to build. They're a little high production for rushes unless you can chop them. And the world has declared war. It looks like Team OP did the declaring. Now yeah, we've got uh, Pio Pata down here. Lots of land north for baggy tax. He doesn't certainly doesn't have to settle south. And that looks like where he's going with his settler. Same for Taz. He can go north a bit. Um, but Arctic's over here. He's going to have to watch. He's, he's by himself. And Blaze is by himself. Taz has a settler out.
Boston's down over here. Mycenae over here. Eiffel's got his settler walking. And Rhodes is over here. And uh, Telecopen over here going south. Ah, he felt we did a trader first. Which, uh, which did he do it going to uh, Aztecs or to one of the city states for the the gold, etc.? Uh, looks like TSOP attacked him. Going to be tight here between TSOP and uh, Arctep. Uh, they're almost doing a duel. Or, or Liskey, I mean. There's Liskey here, TSOP here, and Arctep over here. So Arctip is surrounded, but he's got reinforcing fire from uh, from Liskey on this side. So he's a little better off than Blaze. Blaze is really by himself and has to hold. Liskey is pumping out some warriors. And TSOP, some couple slingers. Looks like Baggy is going to try and... Uh, expand his America first. Hopefully he can pull that off and then uh, use America's advantages later. Let's see what Aztecs and uh, Greece are doing up here. Aztecs got their, uh, I guess, Stresho is going for the expansion first rather than military. He's got his second uh, settler out.
Ah, looks like Stretcho is going to forward settle Blaze. Maybe he's going to use that for a, a military uh, forward settle base. Uh, Blaze has got his second settler out. I wonder where he's going to put him. On the coast? He's trying to get him away from uh, his military units. Blaze is in a tough go. Looks like Efell sent that trader to his other city to build a road. And Tispa and uh, Liski are in a uh, basically a dual uh, uh, warfare here right now. Arctip has his uh, second settler out. Not sure what baggy tax America is doing. Oh, he built a, a, a uh, worker, and he's uh, improving his horses. So maybe he's looking for a horse rush down uh, to the two uh, OP players south of him. Uh, line of warriors coming across to uh, TSOP. But he's not defenseless. Warrior and a slinger sitting there. Not sure what Taz is doing over here. I'm hoping he's uh, going to pump out uh, settlers and uh, build for the future for his team. Definitely looks like uh, um, El Stretcho is going to forward settle uh, towards Blaze and then try and take him out, probably. <laughs> Blaze had better start building more warriors or something. Warriors or slingers. He fells uh, second settlers out. Uh, Liskey's backing off on his warriors. 
not really worth the bottle right now. I got no doubt that OP strategy is gonna is gonna have to be to take out Blaze, uh, and then uh, and then they'll have that half of the continent all to themselves, while uh, you know L Lisky and uh, Arctip hang on over here. Arctip's got his uh, second settler out, and Casey doesn't seem to yet be uh, executing a rush on Arctip. But America may be going for the horse uh, rush. He needs a uh, district down, though. Yeah, I don't see a district uh, yet, so. He's going to need that because he's only got one horse. Unless he settles over here, third city gets a second horse. Ah, oh, Blaze got his horses, and he made an archer over here. He may, he may still have a game against uh, Aztec. Not dead in the water yet. I have no doubt that his teammates probably sent him cash, and he uh, bought that. <sighs> Score is not really a good indication in a team game at this point, but uh, OP is a little bit ahead. Yeah, we're, uh, well, religious religious victory doesn't really mean much here. Uh, Dom victory. OP is leading uh, in military strength. And in science right now. That's a little bit more of an indication. They've uh, put down more cities, I think, by a couple... Uh, that's probably why they're leading and they've built more units. Well, uh, Aztec's going for the rush now with his uh, Aztec warriors. Blaze moved his horse across the river before attacking. Good move. And he's moving up some archers to uh, to here. That's uh, archers and horses. Yes, that's a good plan to... Uh, Defend against Aztec warriors. Let's go over. Let's go over here and see if anything's happening. Basically, still a cold war over here. Uh, warriors versus warriors, slingers. No one's really attacking. Yeah. 
Archetypes doing the same thing. Archers right now are Archers and Warriors. Uh, him and Tsop are uh, basically on top of each other. I'm not sure what Baggy Tax is doing. He hasn't put out a third city. I also don't see a bunch of units. Ah, uh, to Tokyo's got districts. But I don't see horses or uh, iron there for him to uh, build units with. He has to, uh, okay, settler down here to capture these horses. That's what he's doing. So he'll have horses soon down here. And he's built uh, military districts in both his cities. So he's probably planning on, on doing that. Doing a horse rush, taking out Arctip. We'll, but he's uh, you know, he's building archers to defend himself. We'll see how this goes. And he's got three cities too. He fells next uh, city there. Yeah. <laughs> and here's the battle up here right now. Stretcho's got more more uh, Aztec warriors coming out versus versus uh, Blaze with horses and archers. That's for sure some guy. Excellent.
Uh, Blaze better protect his horse, and yeah, he's he's up. He got an upgrade. Yeah, that's good. And the uh, archers are coming up. And a second horse must have probably bought with cash. Uh, I don't think Blaze is going to fall easily, if at all, to Aztecs. Aztecs is going to need help from his teammates. He may be getting cash, too, to buy these Warriors, but this is going to be both teams feeding these two players um, for this war. While they expand themselves. So the other teammates will sim uh, while their two teammates fight it out. Uh, and we have a general, Hannibal Barcia. Now it's rule A, which is only in your borders, but it will make him very difficult to uh, push. Now whether Casey can push, uh, uh, you know, Arctep here in Macedon, but he's got one of his uh, Heritoy warriors out. I'm probably I'm butchering that name, but uh, you get the idea. Eiffel's got his uh, third settler out. Eiffel's definitely trying to pump out and sim uh, so that he can later on uh, help out his team. And there's uh, the battle line being drawn up here. So basically, we've got two battlefronts, uh, one right here with Liskey and Arctep and the rest of KC, and then one up north with Blaze and El Stretcho.
Hey Oz, I'm streaming right now the uh, 4v4. Yep, there's a, it's an interesting map. Tsop is kind of squeezed, but he's got the rest of the K, KC around him. But uh, if he can uh, if he can get help, he's going to be okay. They, they need to move on on Arctep uh, soon, or they're going to, or KC's going to be in trouble. Uh, and Liskey's got his second general up here. Looks like he's going to take out Stockholm. Might be tough, though. Stockholm's got a lot of archers. But uh, Arctip here, he's got his UUs coming out. That's going to be uh, tough to push for KC unless they get a crap load of horses uh, down here soon. I mean, they're working on, uh, Taz is working on the horses here. Uh, so he's going to have to uh, do a horse rush. I know he's built, uh, you know, military districts here. Yeah, T Teslapo has uh he's he's boxing a bit, but his other teammates are around. Um obviously uh Taz is trying to hook up his horses so he can uh do a horse rush, but uh I think uh Arctip is gonna be hard to push out with his do you now. And Lisky's got two generals already. Well, uh, T-Spot just uh, built a, looks like he hard built a sword. We'll see. Uh, looks like uh, Arctip is going to go on the offensive. He's going to try and take out t -Sop.
Yeah, it definitely looks like he's going to try and take out Stockholm so that they're not getting the science, but uh, Stockholm's not an easy uh, kill either. I think the battle will be if uh, Liskey can actually take out Tsop or whether uh, Taz will execute uh, the horse rush on, uh, on Arctep before that. He's got his horse. He's got his horses hooked up now. Baggy's got a settler out finally. He fell settlers going forward up north. And El Stretcho is still trying to take with Art, now backing up with Archers. But, uh, you know, Blaze is no pushover. One, two, three, four, four horses. Uh, and he's taking the fight south to him, too. Yeah, almost got uh, his warrior there. Let's see if uh, Blisky can take out Stockholm and take their science out of the game. <laughs> definitely got a definitely got a battle going on here. I think Tsop's in trouble. But if uh, Taz can execute a horse rush, then they might save them.
Blazers had to back off and uh, let his horses rest there. Uh, basically, uh, El Stretcho was able to use an archer and his warriors, which got injured. It became a stalemate, basically. This is still ongoing. Uh, archers and horses versus archers and Aztec warriors. Uh, no real, they're not really pushing each other. So we'll see, see where this goes. Um, Blaze doesn't have iron working yet or a source of iron, I don't think, uh, to upgrade his warriors. Uh, we'll see where this heads. Blaze is definitely, though, not being uh, being pushed by El Stretcho, um, most likely with the help of his team's financial help anyway.
Yeah, OP is trying to take out TSOP, that's for sure. A double attack from uh, Liskey and uh, Arctip to try and take out TSOP fast here. Uh, I think they're going to succeed with the amount of uh, units they've got there eventually. Uh, I finally got horses and a general coming out of Taz. Uh, he might distract Arctip here. Arctic might have to pull back. And Arctic's trying to get another settler out here, too. Efell's got his city down just south of Laventa, and he's got another settler here. Maybe going up here on this river. Yeah, big battlefield going on here. I don't think El Stretto is going to push too hard, though. He's got another settler going out, probably back, uh, back going.
Well, I don't know how long Chisop is going to hold out. She's uh, lost a lot of units by the looks of it. And got uh, injured horses, you know, all around them.
but Arctip might not uh, be able to help uh, too much longer if uh, Taz actually executes, uh, you know, an attack on his cap over here. America is forward settling down to Stockholm. Let's see what's happening over in this battlefield. Yeah, pretty much a standoff still. No, it has him. It's now finally moving in. Um, Arctic better have more protecting that settler than just a warrior soon.
Arctup's trying to move this settler up here, but uh, Taz knows about it. I don't know whether he'll get over it before with his horses. That's a pretty brave uh, settle that Arctip is doing there. Tsop is hanging on, but he's certainly not going to expand any. Whiskey's got another settler out. Efel's got another settler out going south. Probably, I would think, along this river here. <coughs> 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 And no real movement along the northern battlefield. Uh, Blaze pulled back a horse to heal. Probably have to do the same with that one. Not sure how this battlefield is going to go. El can El Stretcher out resource uh, Blaze or not? I mean, horses are more of a more than a match for uh, Aztec warriors, but they're more expensive.
Macedon must have bought himself a uh, a UU. So I don't remember seeing that uh, along with his warrior there. He he did settle on the right side of the river though. But uh, there's a lot of horses coming. But Taz is going to have to cross the river for him to attack, really. Otherwise, he's going to uh, have a hard time. Still got a bunch of horses. So Greece has uh, basically forward settled Knossos in order to buy tiles to use to attack uh, Tesop. So he could bring his uh, general Sun Tzu up and have it influence uh, the bottom half squares here. Smart move. Uh, not voting well for Tesop because now he's basically, uh, he's got walls. Uh, but no more units down here. He might want to uh, bring his units back here. He's more of a threat here than uh, than Macedon is up here now, because Macedon's going to shift to dealing with uh, Taz. He had better protect his cap. Looks like he's got a couple more settlers out. Definitely uh, doing well on the expansion. 
He never really got pushed. He's doing the pushing. Getting an even bigger battlefield here. I don't know whether El Stretcho can simply overwhelm him with numbers or not. But Blaze is certainly unable to uh, get a third, you know, get a fourth city out here. <coughs> Whereas El Stretcho is. So even if uh, OP is unable to actually kill off uh, a member of the KC team, um, you know we've uh, they're still pulling ahead in points here, and that's going to snowball, especially in a team game. They're building more cities uh, and taking the attack to KC. Now they're going to be Greek city on the other side of this lake. You know, these uh, desert mountains. Well, TSOP did get some units back in. Good, two swords. I'd say Efel's burned up most of his money feeding uh, Liskey and uh, El Stretcho. But Efel's definitely uh, putting himself out there to position for the long haul here. I don't know if KC will CC once uh, Arabia is taken or whether they think they still have a ch chance to take out Arctip. That's their call. But they they basically must take out Arctip here uh, in order to uh, compensate for losing Arabia. Yeah, they got to take out... Uh, they got to take out Arctip here to compensate for uh, losing a TSOP over here. We'll see if Taz manages to take uh, 
take out Arctip, he'll take this city, but can he actually deal him a uh, knockout blow uh, and reel him in before uh, Arabia goes down? That's a tough call. And uh, America isn't really doing anything other than probably feeding gold. But it, it really, he would be needed. I mean, he's bringing down some. Uh, okay, we got a drop here.
right. Oh. <clears throat>
Taz, what's going on with you? You, 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 you connect it, then you disconnect it, Taz. I'm going to rehost. Everyone delete folders. Yes. T Taz connected and, D and then DC'd and baggy tax can't get in. It'll be up in a second. <laughs> yeah, I think that's. I think that's fine. Game is up. I load it turn forty this time. I don't know if forty one was bugged.
<sighs> Taz, you're disconnected again. I have been, yes. Do you, do you want to reboot? Uh, yeah, re reboot uh, your computer, Steam, come back, okay? Taz is having issues. He's going to close Steam out and reboot it. I'm going to rehost again. Well, if Taz can't get back in this time, uh, I don't know if there's any other KC guys around to take his place. <sighs> Game is up. Taz, join in. Well, well, El Stretcho is joining, but Taz joined up before any other KC guys anyway. Okay, you're in. Okay, everyone join in. Okay, guys, join up. Taz is connected anyway, so far. Taz is in and not DC so far. He rebooted Steam. He closed Steam out and rebooted it. So far, so good. Okay. No blaze isn't in yet. Now Lisky disconnected. Oh my fucking god. You can try. Yeah, but
What's the uh, status? Okay. It's a long time though, no luck, right? Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm going to try and do. Yeah, just hold off. I'm going to get bring the, those players in first. Okay, game is up. Lixie can join. Taz joined first. Yeah, but you joined the last time and kicked uh, Liskey out. Uh, game is bugged. I don't know. <laughs> and, and, and anyway, Taz, join up. All right. I, I can't scrap a CCC game. That's freaking. We'd have to play it out and wait. And we just wasted two hours. Okay, Blaze, join up. Taz, are you in all the way? Okay, Blaze. Uh, yeah, because there's only three people here. Mm. 
All right. All right, I got you in. Are you in, Blaze? Okay, uh, TSOP join. Yeah, Sir, sorry, I, sorry, I'm butchering your name. I'm never going to pronounce that right. <laughs> It's 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 had too many consonants. Uh You coming, cell pose? Hurry up and join. I'm waiting for T cell pause to join in. Okay, he is. All right. Okay, Stretcho can join. It took TSOP a long time, too. Okay, you're on. Yeah, that, that's the entire problem. Yep. Canadian host. <laughs> e, e. Yeah. <laughs> e fell, join up. Stretch those in. We, we we did get a like I got seven inches of snow last night here. It is a little bit of a winter wonderland. Not cold really. It's not like it's minus fourteen Celsius. Not cold. Not cold by our standards anyway. <laughs> yeah yeah. <laughs> right. Up on the ski hills you would have, but that's it. Yeah. Uh, okay, have a uh, have our have a uh, arc tip join. I'll have I'll have Baggy join last. Let's do one at a time. <sighs> Let's hope we know in DCs during the game anymore. 
I mean, really, we don't have that many cities on the map. It's not that large. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> Baggy tax, come on in, buddy. I won't even make fun of your accent. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Taz just got kicked. No one even joined, though, right then, unless it's baggy tax is kicking you. Yes. Well, that's what it is. Baggy tax came in. Yeah. Ta Taz, try... As Taz, try and hot join. See if we can uh, get you back in. Try, try joining us, someone, not me. <laughs> yeah, but I can't just scrap a CCC game. Someone's got to win, someone's got to lose. Or we play from scratch, and that's another two hours. Yeah, we can. I think Pavlo's around now. No, I don't think it matters right now. Okay, Pavlo is saying he can sub after 4 p.m. EST. That's quite a while away. That's what he posted in the clan forums. Well, this this is turn 40 right now, not turn 41, because I thought that too. I thought maybe it was turn 41. So we're joining on turn 40 as it is. I wouldn't want to do 39 because uh, there's a lot of war happening. And no one's going to remember two turns of war exactly. Mm. <laughs> okay. We could try that, having Taz join last.
Hey guys, so what's going on? Oh, okay. Yeah, Stampede's in a, in a team game. He's the only one around, I can see. Uh, apparently Taz isn't back rebooting yet. Yeah, I'm used to my SSD right now. <laughs> By the way, Blaze, we're 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 gonna have a chat about Venchen uh, soon here. He's been hanging out on the Korean server and always playing over there. I tagged him twice and he didn't uh, even respond, let alone come and play. So if he's not going to uh, play in, you know in KC then freaking I'm not having him on the team yeah I got that message from him too and neither is Gary he said he uh, doesn't really have any uh, desire to play Civ right now Those two I don't mind, at least they've told us. Freaking Ven Chen is just ignoring freaking us and playing on the Korean server. <laughs> we will just have to do a little more recruiting. Civ six will fall, yeah. I think uh, the legal transition to rise and fall fairly quickly, though, because the, the vanilla games just won't will dry up. Um, it's the way MP is. Yeah, me too. It's the same old meta. I'm looking forward to the new stuff. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> hey Taz. Yeah, they they won't they won't say that they're doing like uh, what's in the patch that they're doing concurrently with Rise and Fall, but I expect a large patch, and hopefully they solve some of the issues. <laughs> That's, that's not fire access so much as it's 2K. 2K will not admit fault for anything. They're the worst freaking game company out there for that. Yeah, I know. They're not, uh, they're not princesses either. <laughs> oh, yeah. I guess we can't all be Blizzard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
either either on me or uh, you know someone else. <laughs> uh, your high end one isn't doing it for you, or is it overheating? Okay. So a good turnaround. <laughs> That's a good good price though. Taz, are you connecting at all? No, we didn't re lobby. Uh, Blaze, bl okay, everyone's like, I'm going to re lobby. Yes. Taz, Taz, come on in. Okay, people join up. Taz is in, <laughs> at least for now. Yeah, those are tomorrow. Yes. Fifteen minutes after the round one's one starts, or when the teams are done their previous games. 
it's a it's a it's a round robin type thing. Yes. Okay. Yeah, join up. Yeah, we can hear you, Liski. Yeah, jo join up. Like, I'm not calling people in individually, just join up. I doubt it. I d and NWA couldn't play the first 4v4, so I think they're done for today, other than maybe a 2v2s. Come on, come on, let's go, let's go. <laughs> Let's, let's just go with it. It should sync up in the game. Stretcho, are you going to check in? Yeah, and then the House of Cards comes down. I mean, this game was smooth for 40 turns. <laughs> Well, if NW is not going to show, no, we're not rescheduling team games. We're if they can't show up, they get DQ'd, and then we'll move on to the next game. Yes. Best for first moves. I am not reloading.
Great. What happened, Taz? You just DC'd? All right, I got the game up. Well, if, if KC wants to CC, that's a decision for them to make. Oh, sorry, I had my mic switch off. If Casey wants to CC, that's up to them. We'll have to have that discussion. So I don't think they get a player to replace Taz right now. Yeah, that would be the thing. Give them a second. Yeah, Pavlo said he wouldn't be on to like four. Um, Stampede's in a game. He's the only one else actually on. I, I mean, I think they've got the game. Uh, it's just a matter of time. They're gonna they're gonna take uh, T T Spaws off out. Yeah, he's just simming his heart out. Yes. Yeah, I see the whole game. You know. Um, I mean, Blaze, you're holding your own with the help of your team's money, probably. But you can't, yeah, you and Stretcho can't push against each other, and you're not going to expand. You guys are losing the the the, the simming race here, uh, even if you even if you survive. Yeah, but uh, they, they'll lose that one city because he was stupid to plant it. But uh, I don't think you're going to take any more of his cities, and, and you're going to be taken out. But you're, but you're losing the sim war. Efel is just over there simming his heart out. He's going to turn into a friggin' golden industrial powerhouse. <laughs> Science, yeah. And we don't have a sub to, to replace Taz. Yes. Yeah. I mean, I put I put our our entire roster as subs, but no one's here. <laughs> yeah.
<laughs> well, well, I I rostered everyone that was active is what I did as a sub. Yeah. Oh yeah, I know. They were rostering people that are just on their server. <laughs> Yeah, I know, and it could it could be just something today. It could be Steam. Uh, it could be anything, Taz. I'm not blaming you. Mm. Mm. <laughs> All right. All right, Blaze. I'm not in the game. You're you're the the KC lead. You go tell OP. <laughs> but we've got uh, we've got other games today. I mean, we've got uh, two more of these games and the two v two. So we've got games to play, guys. Don't take off. <laughs> All right, Baggy. No, I can't sub. I've seen the whole freaking game. <laughs> they're 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 get, they're they're winning. They're get, they're getting the CC. So I can't sub at, and after being host. Nah. Hey, I, I can't sub. I've seen the entire game. That wouldn't be fair. And you guys are going to win anyway. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I mean, it would take a long time. I mean, I mean, you're not pushing Blaze that hard uh, right now, but, uh, you know, yeah, yeah, you're expanding. He can't, uh, and and uh, Arabia is going to eventually freaking get KO'd, even though we took a city over there. But uh, I mean, that was just a bad plan. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, Efel is simming his freaking heart out, and it's and we're not going to stop him. <laughs> no, we 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 see the long term game is uh, we may survive, they may survive, but we're not going to win this. Even if even if we took our tip out, uh, you take Arabia out, you, we take our tip out, you're still going to win. <laughs> All right. Okay. Good game, guys. Yeah. Yes. And uh, well, is uh, you're playing against Sun Tzu, isn't it? Or don't we rotate these things? Let me check the schedule here. Uh... They're, they're no showing. Yes. Yeah. Let me check here. All right. So game one is Sun Tzu versus NWA, which I think I believe was a no show. There's our game, which is game two. Uh, game three is you versus Sun Tzu. So that's what's ne that's what's next for you guys. And it's us versus NWA is game three. The other game three, or ga actually it's mislabeled, it should be game four. So you're playing, you're playing Sun Tzu. Um, so whenever they can play. Yes. <laughs> Okay, 
make contact with Sun Tzu up top there. You guys are ready to play them. Um, KC's getting a bye because there's no way NWA is showing up. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm sure they're good for that. So uh, OP plays Sun Tzu. Sun Tzu's ready, so that game will go ahead. Um, you guys, NWA is not going to play, so we get that is, we get, yeah. Talk to NWA Blaze. You're the you're the lead for KC for this, and uh, let me know. Um, it would be a Guthy, a Guthy and Doggo. I think are around. Yeah. Yep, I'm here. Um, right now, uh, KC is playing uh, NWA, and NWA is going to be a no show probably. So let's so. Uh, no, um, no, we don't play. The, it's not a perfect round robin. Yeah, it's not. It's not everyone against everyone. Um, Game one was Sun Tzu versus NWA. Game two was the one we just played, OP versus KC. Game three is game three is OP versus Sun Tzu. And game four is NWA versus KC. So our game should be versus NWA, but they're not, you know, able to put four players in, I don't think. <laughs> yeah. Oh, are they? I don't see NWA around. Where are, they, where are they at? Okay. Yeah, that they should be playing that game, yes. So that's, that's game one then, and we were game two. So uh, maybe you got time for your duel uh, while they uh, play out. <laughs> okay, I guess that's not happening right now. Sunsi's got a large roster. Maybe they can sub out, but they I can't tell them to sub sub them out if they don't have anyone. Yeah. Yeah, I just got I just heard that. Okay. All right. So we're both waiting. To, so both OP and KC are waiting for this that game to finish because they're they're our future opponents. So is is their game streaming friggin at all? Do we know how far along it is? <laughs> okay. Hey guys, anyone streaming this game? But there's no, there was no host for this, right? Okay, well, yeah, we can't do it all the time, but all right, how's the game going? No, you don't have to bother streaming. I was just wondering if you guys had a host that was streaming or not, but you don't. I was just trying to figure out how far this game was along and what time we think it'd be over. Because basically, uh, OP and KC are waiting for this game to be over. <laughs> yeah, that's Blaze, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Are you playing an islands map or something else? Okay. All right. I'll leave you guys to it. Just check in once in a while. Mm. 